All right, what's up, everybody? My name is Derek. And I'm Kurt. And today, we're opening some packs for the free agency week one. Um, I do not know when the other weeks are coming out. I'm guessing it's going to be like normal, like on like, a Wednesday or Friday. Like, I don't... like next Wednesday? Yeah. Ma or maybe, maybe next Monday. Maybe this Friday or something. I don't know. Yeah, we, we don't know yet. But we got a Joe Thune. Free Agency Master. 98 overall. Jadevion Clowny Master. We do not know if you can put any team chemistry on him. Because I do know that the Jack Conklin, you cannot. You can't? Mm. Okay. And what overall the, is he? He's, he's a 92. A nine, yeah, 92. Okay. Because when you go in there, it only has the uh, base chems, like the go deep and stuff like that. Okay. Um, and then maybe you tried doing they, that without a power up. He doesn't have a power up. Oh, he, so wow. He maybe doesn't. the ones with the power ups you can. Uh, these two you get their power up when you do it, which is pretty cool. And you get two of the heroes back. The heroes are Philip Rivers, Lamar Miller, Hunter Henry, Nadamkin Sue, Anthony Harris, and Chris Harris Jr. Um, pretty good so far. Yeah, um, you can also get a free 96 overall. What, what are they called, Hero? Yes. Yeah, okay, so you can get a free 96 overall Hero. Not right now. Not right now? Nope. Oh, I, th I saw in the stream that you could, but... Uh, but um, but still, you, you will be able to get one, right? Yes, yes. Okay, so that's interesting. I wonder if you can do, do 96s as any team. I have no idea. I don't know, well, but so far... Because this one only has 100 stars right now. Oh, okay. And it takes 120 to get it. Okay. So I um, at, at rate rate the promo so far just one to ten. Just from not even opening packs yet or anything, rate it from one to ten. I think it's an eight. I th you know I think a seven or eight right now. I think it's really good so far. I really think it's really good. Um, but we also said that about the combine promo. Did we say that about the I combine promo? I think we promo? said like six or seven. Maybe. Well, this this deserves an 8, then. I'll give it an 8. So what are we doing today, Derek? We're opening the free agency packs. The free agency packs? Okay, what are the odds? Pretty good odds. Wow. That is pretty good. Probably the lowest you can get is an 87, right? Free agency card. But, um, but yeah, so today we do not have questions, and this will not be normal. This is, like, kind of almost a one-time thing. Yeah. We don't know what... Also, we don't know what the animation looks like, so... I do. You cheated? That, that, that's lame. Automatically drops to a six. Yep. Automatically yep. drops to a six. Yep. That sucks. But um, let's talk a little bit about the free agency so far. free agency. So now, far. let's not talk about the signings real quick. Let's talk about the trades. Um, the, oh. we'll, start, we'll start off with the Jacksonville Jaguars. Ooh, pretty good. Not bad. Um... Traded, uh, what's his name? Uh, this Calais. is the first trade that we heard about, and it was... We're not going to go over everything. We're going to go over the... It was, from that trade, it is the worst trade that I've ever seen. Yeah, okay, so, okay, well, no. But it gets worse. I, I don't think it's the worst trade that they've, I've ever seen. Um, now, here's here's what happened, guys. Calais Campbell, right? Yep, one of the, For the best defensive linemen in the league right now. He, I mean, he might have ha he might have had like an off season, maybe. I don't even yeah. know if he had an off season, but you know, the team wasn't that good, but they traded him for a what was it? A 5th round pick. 5th round pick. I just I'm baffled. To Baltimore. I just I can't believe they traded him for that little. I just can't believe they traded him. I think they could have got a 3rd round pick. I think they could have gotten something better. And obviously, I feel like the Jacksonville Jaguars are a little bit in rebuilding mode. Oh, yeah. I feel like, heck, you could go get like a young player that maybe you kind of believe in just a little bit. You know, that not a lot of... Oh, my Lord. Oh, man. Oh, my gosh. All right. Well, that's pretty crazy. My God. Uh, yeah. Um. But, yeah, I just, I just think that they gave him away way, way too way, cheap way, yeah, way, way too, too cheap. cheap and I, I think they're just tanking right now because i you were saying they're trying to trade uh now i don't know how to say his name nagak the Nagaku, yannick yeah. nagakwe or yeah, something Nagakwe, like that way, yeah. um they're probably gonna trade him during the draft 
the, yeah. They're yeah. going to try and trade up mm-hmm. and trade him with that. Yeah, so the first off, I did not like that trade. That trade was awful. And then the next day, mm-hmm. the next day, like I, the, the, that trade that with um, Calais Campbell, I was like, you know, I, a I, bad trade. I didn't, I, but nothing like now. Nothing th- like the next trade that we're Texans into. traded. Oh my goodness! DeAndre Hopkins for David Johnson. A half-eaten sandwich. No, <laughs> That's okay. What people have been saying. Okay, I understand that David Johnson has been hurt for a long time. Yeah. Or like he gets hurt a good a good amount, but David Johnson is still a beast, right? Yeah. yeah. But there is no way in this world I would have traded pro- debatably the best receiver in the league. Yeah. For sure, like top three, right? Yeah. Um, no way in the world I would have traded him for David Johnson, who has a big freaking contract. And the, the reason was they didn't want to pay him. Well, David Johnson has a huge contract. I think I thought they had something good in Carlos Hyde, who this was his first season where he didn't get hurt, so that was yeah. looking good, and and um and he had a thousand yard rushing season, and you still had Lamar Miller, but you had to sign him and stuff. But whatever, I just like I would I was going throughout the day and I was like this can't be real. No, I was like this can't be real. No. This, 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 that's the dumbest trade I've ever seen, and um and I I mean I love David Johnson. I really really do like David Johnson, but dude, but guys, I just I just can't believe it. I just can't believe it. Um. I just, uh, even now, like, what is it, two, three days later, yeah. two days later, I just can't believe it. I really just can't believe it. it I just, I can't believe I don't even want to talk about it no more because I can't believe it. But do you want to say anything else about it? I I went into that day, like, the Calais Campbell trade was the worst trade I've ever seen. And then that next day, the, the Texans are like, hold my beer. Like, <laughs> oh my goodness. I, I don't know. I think you're exaggerating the Calais Campbell trade a little bit. I, I don't mean, think. So I don't I, think it's. I don't think it's like insanely, insanely, insanely bad. Like, I don't think it's nowhere. Like nowhere near the DeAndre Hopkins, David no, Johnson not at trade level. All. And like, I felt like the Texans had like, like, like they they could, they could. I mean, I'm not gonna say they're Super Bowl contenders, but. They were good, and they could fight to make it to the Super Bowl. Now I just don't know. Like, who are the receivers? You have you have one of the... Will Fuller. Yeah. Well, but he gets hurt a lot, and, like, yep. he ain't no DeAndre Hopkins. Now, who are the receivers, you know? I just... I mean, you had you had one of the best wide receivers, and debatably... Well, not even debatably. I'd say for sure top 10 quarterback in the league. Yep. And he's young. And he's young, you know? Um... What happens when they want to pay? When they're going to have to pay Deshaun Watson? Is they're Bill gonna, is Bill O'Brien him. is Bill O'Brien going to trade him? Bill O'Brien has way too much power. Way too much power. It's ridiculous, and I don't even think he's that good. I think he's. I mean, I think the Chiefs might have still won, but um, he's a big reason why they lost in the playoffs. Remember when we were watching it, and yeah. he he called. They were up like twenty four to like Under maybe it, it was like 20. three or seven. On right. their own 20. And they went, they did like a fake punt on their own 20 when they were up by like 14 to 20 points. Something like that. I don't know. I just, me and Derek couldn't believe it. But anyway. We, we're, we're dogging on Tyler. We were like, oh, the Patrick, Patrick Mahomes is going to lose. And then they did that. And then, 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 then you could say, Bill Brown was like, wait, hold, hold my, my beer. beer. Yeah, hold you know? my beer. <laughs> That's funny. That's funny though. Um. But we we haven't even actually gotten to the actual free agency. We, yeah. we we're only talking about the trades. Okay, what, so what was another trade that happened though? Another trade? I can't think of one off the top of my head. I'm sure there's a couple. Um, I'm just gonna go through some. James Bradbury. Yep. Got a big old payday. Yeah, forty five mil. Yep. Yeah, um, big old payday for the Giants. How you feel? I think I, I, thought, I, wanted, I think it's a good pickup. I wanted Byron Jones, but I'm happy. I'm. Dude, no way. Dude, Dude, that's pretty good. Two series redux out of these packs? That's pretty good, man. All right, we'll go I'm, ahead. But I'm happy with it. I'm not mad at it. We needed a veteran quarterback that could teach DeAndre Baker and um, I think it's Beal or Love, one of those two. Mm-hmm. Um, 
show them the way. I think we got some stud cornerbacks, honestly. And then we try. Then we signed Blake Martinez. I mean, it's better than what it, you had. Yeah, but I I would rather Joe Shorbert. Joe, Sh yeah. Uh, where'd he go? I don't think he's been signed. He's yet. been signed. Has he? Yeah, he got then a big have, old payday. Then too. I have no idea. He got a big payday. Um, I forget where he got signed though. Um, but yeah, I think I think Bradbury was a really good, really he, good pick. He's a great corner. Amazing corner. They have not get any anybody on the offensive line though. No, they have not, which they probably need to do. Because um, I would rather them get Isaiah Simmons in the draft with Blake Martinez because that linebacker core with David Mayo and Blake Martinez and Isaiah Simmons, that, that'd be a deadly linebacker core. But most likely they're going to they're gonna trade back, maybe even with the Jags, get um, the Goku. I don't yeah. know. And... Um, get him, and trade back and pick up an offensive lineman. But they also re-signed or franchise tag Leonard Williams. I mean, since they got him for pretty much nothing anyway and traded for a third-round pick for someone that was going to go in the free agency the next year anyway, signing him back, I mean, was probably the logical step to do. Yeah, um... I think the Giants are doing pretty good so far. Yeah. I think the Giants are doing pretty good so far, but... We can turn these into uh, 90s. What do you mean? You can turn the 87s into 90s. Really? Yeah. Because it'll oh. change. Okay, so. well, um, so let's 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 not take too much time on each topic, because there's yeah. one we're probably going to take a good amount of time on. But, so, Byron Jones to the Dolphins. Dude, number the one pick. Dolphins no are going to oh, be yeah, guys, good. Watch out for the Dolphins. I see them potentially winning the division. I'm not kidding, um, especially if they get Melvin Gordon. Um, right? They got Ryan Fitzmagic. Uh, they got. I mean, Byron the, Jones. the number one landing spot, the number one landing spot for Melvin Gordon is Miami, and I think he wants to go there. So I think that's. And they still have a lot of cap. Yeah, I think that's. I think that's what's gonna happen. To be honest with you, who all did they sign? They signed. Um, Byron Jones. Byron Jones. Um, another big player. I forget. I, I forget, but they. I forget, but the Dolphins are not done, guys. They signed a linebacker, didn't they? I think they signed a linebacker, but I forget. I'm watch out for the Dolphins, guys. I'm telling you, I think they're potential division winners. All um, I know is the Dolphins have took most of the free agents that I wanted the Giants to sign. Yeah, I think I think the Dolphins are killing this free agency and stuff. Um, but yeah, that's it. Yeah. Okay, I wonder if you think there's a bigger animation. Probably. I don't Probably know what kind of animation? Yeah, I'm I'm extremely disappointed with the animation this year. It's terrible, but we can talk about some other things. So just this is gonna be real quick. Just a quick opinion on Teddy Bridgewater to the Panthers. I like it. You like it? I, I do too. I think I think it's I think it's a solid pickup. I think it's a solid pickup. Um, well, okay. So do you have but any? But who he's gonna have to play for the next two three years? It's gonna be interesting. Uh, it's just gonna be interesting. But um, let's get into let's just get into the big one, I guess. Tom Brady to the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. What do you think I, about I that? I saw it coming. What do you What do you think about it? I saw it coming, but man. Well, he, I mean, no, has, no one has... thought about the Tampa Bay Buccaneers for the last. Like, I mean, it's when they start talking about that. They, I mean, like everybody was talking about Tampa or not Tampa, the Chargers and the Raiders. Yeah. You know. Where where did where did where did Tampa come from? You know. Well, I mean, for the last few weeks, they I think they have been talking about him going to the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Yeah. It was either them or the Chargers. Yeah. To me. Ah, uh, you sure? Yeah. To me, it was only them or the. Because Chargers. I think if we go back in our videos, I think we were dead set on. I think everybody was dead set on. The Raiders. I was dead set on the Chargers. Yeah, um, I'm kind of glad he's not going to the Chargers. The Chargers are not looking good. I'm sorry if you're a Chargers fan, but the Chargers are just not looking good. And, uh, but yeah. And, but he has one of the best receiving cores in the league. Yeah, I I, also, I, I. I also have heard rumors that they are not off of not getting or getting uh, Antonio Brown. I think, I mean, if they get Antonio Brown, man. That's probably the best receiving core ever. I mean, I think w without a doubt it is, oh, without yeah. a doubt. But um, 
But yeah, it's just crazy. It's just crazy. Um, I think Tampa's going to be good. And I think they just need... All right. What? I, th I thought there would be a, uh, you know, big animation. We'll check. Go, go do this upgrade. We'll see here. All right. So you can't get a team yet. I think I think you're gonna have to put him into a power up. That's what's gonna have to happen. I think that it. I, put him I don't into know. a power up. If we can. You want you want to do that real quick? Yeah, because I want. Right. I definitely want to see if you can put any chemistry on him. All right, we'll be right back, guys. We're gonna figure this out. Yep. Go ahead. All right, guys. So we are going to check and see if no, we cannot. Nope. No, you can't put him on. Maybe maybe the masters. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe they just knew that if they did that, theme teams would be just way too overpowered. Well, I mean, that would be the only reason that free agency comes out. No, I know, no, not really, because you get players like that. Like maybe <coughs> someone's running a Chargers theme team, or, or just to give people better cards. That's why they do it. Um, but I think, I mean, e it sucks obviously because if, I would have loved to have. If the Masters can get it, then it's not totally a bust but if even they if they can't i wouldn't say it's a bust to me it would be a bust i don't i don't this think this is what i was excited for put any chemistry on these players but yeah i was hoping for that and i was excited but still i don't think that is the only reason why they do this they do yeah. it to give people like philip rivers another card or uh i don't know most likely tom brady's gonna get a card or oh, yeah or Thuni or Jadavion Clowney who really needed an upgrade. That's that's why they do this. They, that's why they do every promo is to give people upgrades and get new cards in the game. But but it does suck a little. I understand what you're saying. It does suck a little bit that you can't do that. But it, you got to admit, what what would happen if you could put any team on, on, on these cards? Really Theme good. teams would be insane. Like yeah, almost that's... unstoppable. Almost unstoppable. But guys, let us know what you guys think of the also, promo. Also, do you guys think movers are going to come? Movers. Movers. Since the hmm. DeAndre Hopkins trade. Do you think like there will be some limited movers or something? And, and the draft. I think there, I think, I don't I don't know. I think there should be some limited time cards. I don't know if there will be a whole dedicated promo yeah, to movers. Me either. But, but I think there will be limited time cards. Yes, if there's limited time cards, that will be amazing. Yeah, yeah, that'd be crazy. But guys, that's going to be the end of the video. A little bit of a longer video. But we, there's a lot to talk about. There's a lot to talk about. Let us know. Leave questions about free agency or whatever. Um, like, we didn't uh, answer any questions today, but that's not normal. We just, so much has happened. We just wanted to talk about the free agency and the trades, which, oof, I just don't know. But um, so far, go to rate the promo now. What do you think? One to ten. Six. No okay. animation. For, a, for you saying it's a it might be a bust, that's a pretty high rating. I'm not going to lie. If, if the Masters can't get them, to me, the master. to me it's a bust. Because that's what I wanted out of the free agency promo. Okay. But there is no animation. It's yeah, that's that's, animation. that's pretty. That, that's um, I just can't believe that The heroes one. cannot put any chemistry on them. Any team chemistry. Yeah, any team chemistry. And that's about it for me. Yeah, I, I mean, I, I'm going to give it a six as well um i don't think it's a bust i think i still think it's pretty good i think there's some really good cards out there for people who definitely you know especially if you're running theme teams like jadavion Clowney. well even if you're not running a theme team jadavion Clowney needed an upgrade and i think they knew that, that they had this planned you know what i mean yeah um but yeah i just i just the thing where that, do you think Clowney is gonna sign i think he's gonna go back with seahawks I can see it. I, I think they they said something about him giving them giving him the best offer today. I saw that, but I don't know. But um, I think that the thing that the kicker on this one that makes me go lower. I'm debating a five or a six out of ten. Is the animation? Come the animation. on, man. Come on. Like come on. But uh, maybe there's a reason for that. I don't know. And maybe I I just don't know. But guys, that's gonna be the end of the video. You got anything else to say? Well, that's going to be the video. Pro there's going to be other weeks or yeah. parts, I guess you would say, yeah. um, of this promo. So be expecting that. Uh, Ultimate Legends this Saturday, right? Saturday, come out Saturday. And but Friday, new series. Oh, Friday's new series. So better pack odds. You know what that means. New series. Better pulls. 
Oh, new se- Oh, yeah, Lamar Jackson. You, yeah. you know, the honors. But anyway, guys, a lot of things coming up from that, so be ready. That's a minute. Just enjoy the like and subscribe to the next time. Peace. Peace.